You know what's great about Misha not being here? We get to hear another loud and tight song. Am I allowed to make a request, Swank? Yeah. Or no, am I not allowed to? Oh, no. totally what about the, the prom tune? Yeah! Big fan of that one. Can we do that? Is that cool? Absolutely. Alright. This is, I, I made this request. Hey, you know, that's up tuning. You know what I, I thought earlier? What, what do you think? You guys, uh, drink Misha's, uh, just a little bit of drink, uh, Misha's water. I should drink some Misha's water? Just open it, just have a little sip, and then put it back, and that'll have a little joke. <laughs> and then we should sneak in this room and take his toothbrush. <laughs> no, Lou, I want everybody in the band to lick the cap. <laughs> come on, hot car, I'll lick the cap. Come on, come on. Prom song. This is the song we would sing if we were playing your prom. <laughs> Uh, 
so, so, uh, what do you guys want to... Wow, your hair is lovely. Is it... Wow. You are sitting there with blue hair. She, I said, wow, your hair is lovely. Blue ringlets going like this, and she... The person next to her. You couldn't possibly be talking about me. I'm going to Grace. Oh, you're my Grace? Uh, are 
assholes. <laughs> they don't understand real, genuine comedy when they see it. Um, and sometimes they get frustrated with us. So do I, actually. I get frustrated with us as well. But I get them. I get frustrated with Jared and them. Um, sometimes we are, I mean, now having been a, a director of an episode, I see, oh, it's really, you really are trying so hard to get the day's work done. And it's not easy. There's so much to get done. And when your actors start looking around and making what they think are funny jokes, which aren't, um, <laughs> it can feel to the director frustrated. Um, John Battle, director of an episode recently, um, Jared and I were not being cooperative. <laughs> <laughs> Um, see, I have a tiger. All the time. Raising him 
like and what he's saying is he's saying and he says it the same way every time is completely unintelligible gibberish. <laughs> I, I have the tiger comes out and then the rest of it tell us he's talking about. And he thinks he's hearing something, but it's it's different from what the rest of us are hearing. Um, yeah. So I'm sorry. Did you you have those? Um yeah, I have one. What is it? Do, do you guys know the song called K? Hey? And 
did you say something? Oh, I thought you were just trying to shine my shoe. I didn't know what you were going to come with that. I had no idea. I had a ring. You had a ring? I thought you were polishing your ring. Uh, I didn't know. I had no idea what you were doing. So what are you saying? Uh, well, I mean, you have an answer to me. Well, well I don't know. I still don't know the question. Well, never mind then. Okay. <laughs> I have other tutors, so... Dodge that bullet. <laughs> I have other tutors, so I, oh. you know, I just need to know. Okay. But, um, my actual question is, um, I also
I get to come up with ideas of really weird shit to have them do when they do it. Um, <laughs>
Kimba's a great name. I mean, you're, you kind of lucked out on that deal. Can you imagine if you had to call Charlie? <laughs> Is that your mom right here? I'm here. Where? I'm right here. Oh, hi. Is this true, what we're hearing? Absolutely true. Do you have other children? No. No. Oh. <laughs> so your Charlotte is just sort of floating. Can you take your phone, Charlotte? <laughs> um, what is your middle name, Kayla? Jane. 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 Did your dad pick that too? No, my mom named it after my grandma. So you've got the middle name. That's okay. Do you, have, do you know your grandma? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Sometimes I can ask a student. Um, and I'm going to just guess because I'm an angel, so I have psychic powers. Your grandma's name is Jane. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a mini of two shirt that you wear? Yes. I like it. Thank you. I like your um, tutu as well, or skirt, or whatever we call it. What do you call it? A skirt. Okay. <laughs> I feel like I've learned a lot. <laughs> she nodded like, yes. Yeah, okay. Well, wait, wait, do you have something else to say? It seems like you might. No. You were breathing. Was breathing? <laughs> breathing or yawning? It's the one thing from another. Hang on. Alright. Look, your mom's holding Charlotte up and taking pictures of her. Really, there, there's nuance in this that you can't really pick up on, but 
apparently she, all, all of a sudden, out of the blue today, started saying, Misha Collins. <laughs> and then, <laughs> and then finished, and every time she would say it, she would go, <laughs> And the funny thing about it is, we know with certainty that she has no idea what Misha Collins is. <laughs> she doesn't know what it is that she's saying. It's this weird combination of sounds that she's heard that she thinks is kind of funny. So you know, Misha Collins. <laughs> Um, but yeah, Wes, Wes said that he wants to um, to work on the stage. He's he's um, he recently. Um, I usually cook fairly healthy food that the kids like, not pasta with jam sauce. I cook. Oh, I'll, make, uh, I'll make um salmon with some rice and a salad, and usually. West eats it, they won't eat it, and they love it. And, and West will do this happy thing, like he'll get his little harmless plastic fork and help. <laughs> he'll do this sort of bouncing back and forth with happiness as he's eating healthy food. Um, he, and he's really into balsamic. He wants salad, balsamic food, dressing on it. Uh, which I thought, wow, that's super sophisticated. My son, you know, <laughs> other parents have this problem where their kids only eat goldfish, but my son, he likes balsamic dressing. <laughs> because he's very advanced. Um, and then, uh, but it's got, it's got the kind of control, because now he's putting, he put, he won't eat anything unless it has balsamic dressing on it, including cereal. <laughs> and it's disgusting, and it's definitely not sophisticated. Trying to get him to stop putting balsamic on it, and he steadfastly refuses to eat sometimes unless there's balsam balsamic on whatever it is. Um, It'll pass. He also does this other this this other thing around here, which I have, um, which I find interesting. Um, he if I serve him something that he doesn't like, um, he kind of takes it a little bit personal. Um, it's as if um, it's as if I've said, you know, by serving him something that isn't to his taste, that I've never loved it. <laughs> so he'll take a bite of something, and then he'll sit down, take a bite, and go.
Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're going to have to take off your stockings. <laughs> oh, wow, it's prominent. That's like a nice patch of real estate. Your team had to pay for it? For, for me. You're paying for it for the rest of your life. So, <laughs> Uh, I think it's great. I think it's great. I like your your yes. What? They spelled this was wrong. <laughs> Spelling mistakes on tattoos are so annoying. Um, okay, so finish finish your question about the the Pope tattoos. There were five people, five people competing for the for the. For my group, who were thinking about doing it, and thinking maybe we get more points as more people do it, and then maybe we get so many points as each of each member does it. But at the end, only one did it. Only one group. Right? That would have been an impressive feat it if everyone have. had come in and marked it. Some were creepy. <laughs> oh, they're all a little creepy. I mean, let's be honest. But I saw one that evolved, evolved into, the, into the octopus. Oh, yeah, I saw that one too. The Elipus yeah. Pope the thing. Yeah. Come closer to the microphone and, and lift it up. It's set for, a, I think, a nine year old. <laughs> Yeah. You can just, I don't know, bend over or whatever. You can work it out. Um, yeah, so Go very close. It's a harmless microphone. Like this? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, so, unlike with the mountains, like those are epic peaks, time walking stuff. Yeah. We were just like, yeah, climb the mountains, just climb the mountains, just do it. Did someone on your team do it? We didn't. We you didn't. wanted to. You but didn't. We didn't, no. no. Nobody was like near a mountain. Yeah. And at the end of the week, because I flew out to California to my friend for the week, and at the end you added some music. Yeah. And I lived in New York essentially, and then you added like go to somewhere in New York and take a picture with that person. I'm like, okay, now it's time for What's the question? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now the question is like, what was your favorite item this week? Is this uh, um. What was my favorite? I don't, I don't know. There were a lot of really good ones. Um, there's some amazing renditions of each item, so it's really hard to pick a favorite one. Um, I, I think about the, the NASA one the most because I'm still talking to the director of solar system exploration, which I think is amazing. Um, and I'm getting a tour of, of Jet Propulsion Laboratories next week. Um, I think I've overextended with that guy. I, I'm like, oh, awesome, great, I'm going to bring everyone I know. <laughs> I need to cut it back. I'm only allowed to bring three other people. So, Can which has been ugly in my group of friends. <laughs> no, I've, I have had to sort of figure out who likes me the most. Bring most. strangers. What's that? Bring strangers? Bring strangers, then your friends aren't upset. You're available? <laughs> She, she grabbed her bear. Yes, she has a stuffed bear next to her. She's like, yes, I am available. <laughs> As if that's the international sign for readiness. Hold your stuffed animal at chest level. <laughs> um, yes, I, I have many, many uh, excellent items. Did you already No. No, it's okay. You, I think you did great. And you stood up to the audience when they started heckling you. They said, hurry up, what's the point? And you said, yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, you know, that's true. That's true. You've got to be strong with these people because they will push you around. I said, hi. Hi. Um, first of all, this is a very exciting experience for me. <laughs> and my question is, if you ever switched places with your character one day, what would you do? Wait, we've already had that question. No. No, no, you think oh, you I hung out with them. With him. <laughs> Stop heckling me. <laughs> <laughs> I think that would anything right Um, I don't know. What, what would you do if you could suddenly be Casper? Mess with Jared? <laughs> I 
I have a problem. <laughs> Make sure I don't talk to anyone the whole time just so I don't say something noticeable. <laughs> you want to like, try, try, like, try to pass as Cass, and you're afraid that people will be like, okay, you're not really Cass. You're someone else occupying his, his body. Is that what you're afraid of? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Legitimate <laughs> concern. Um, yes? She's holding up five. Are you holding up five as well? Okay. Great. Oh, that's ten total? <laughs> Um, who, who is next? Who's next? Is there another panel after this, or is this it? Pictures. What? Photo ops. Photo ops. I guess there'll be some, somebody tomorrow. Yeah. Whose who's panel is next tomorrow? Jared and Jensen. Jared and Jensen. Jared and Jensen. Jensen. And Elena. Um, <laughs> yeah, but no, first. The next oh, 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 next panel. Okay, well, what's your question? <laughs> And 
people drove over from the studio to the monitors just to watch, to watch me <laughs> fall apart. They were like, oh, you, you got to get over here somewhere. <laughs> they are not letting it go. So they did. They drove over and they watched. And they thought it was funny. So that, that, they should be guilty about that. I wasn't guilty. I was just... A Hi. Hi. Uh, it's nice to see you. Nice to see you as well. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I was just wondering what do you think Kevin's favorite song would be and why? <laughs> favorite song, and Rob and I have often talked about this, uh, oh, take it away. <laughs> 